Spooky season is in full swing, and one of the ways people like to celebrate is by enjoying something scary, like going through a haunted house. And there are many great haunted experiences in our area, but a new one just opened up this year, and it will only be here for the month of October. That's right. Michelle Oliver went to check out the ghosts on the balcony haunted. Wait, the ghosts on the the ghosts on the balcony haunted experience at Birmingham Theater, powered by Imagine. Let's see if she got spooked. I'm spooked. Blah blah blah. Be it a crazed carnival performer or a terrifying werewolf. <laughs> if it goes bump in the night, it's not hard to get a fright out of me. I hate walking through a dark hallway where I don't know what's going to come up. <laughs> and there are plenty of scary sights at Ghosts on the Balcony, the haunted experience at the Birmingham 8 Theater. We had a, a dry spot in the, the film schedule, and you know our employees have insisted this building has been haunted for years. Wait, so this place is actually haunted? The best one that I've heard recently is we, we recently had an electrician in the building who was working in the basement and heard bowling balls uh, rolling, and uh, he refuses to come back, and, and it turns out many, many years ago, in fact, there was a bowling alley in the basement here. To create this spooky attraction, they partnered with Blue Water, the group behind Glenlore Trails. Like other haunted houses, this is a linear journey through. However, unlike a traditional haunt, uh, this has, uh, we really leaned heavily into the theater. Um, there is a lot more uh, production value, um, there are uh, storytelling moments, uh, there's, there's a story arc through the whole experience. To really understand what they mean, you have to experience it. You're going the wrong no, way! Yes, I found that out! <laughs> have you met the doctor yet? No, 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 so Dr. Baldwin is our fictitious theater proprietor, and he, uh, in, in the story, um, he went mad, and you'll have to come to the theater to uh, understand why. Um, but in, in going mad, he started performing experiments on guests in the name of art, and filming them and documenting them, and committing terrible, terrible atrocities. The greatest director on the planet! They also leaned into the building's history. This building's almost 100 years old, and uh, originally it was built in the 20s as a single screen live playhouse. There's a lot of history, a lot of stories about actors and actresses and, and owners through the Great Depression had some bad times here. So I think that all plays into the history of this building and, and why it's haunted. It was creepy, and the jump scares always seemed to get me. So have you done this before? Is that why you're not jumping as much as me? <laughs> It's a good haunt. So it is um, part theatrical performance and it is part haunt. So the uh, upper floor is much more theatrical and the lower floor is, is pretty terrifying. I went through the adult version, but there's a family friendly haunt as well. Tickets start at $20. I think I made it through. Did I do it? No more? Oh, more. I'm not done yet. We have a lounge at the end. Um, guests are welcome to, to stay and hang out and experience um, uh, the entertainment, the seasonal concessions, and we'll, we'll have a stream going uh, in the lounge of some of the rooms in the haunts. So if you're in the mood for a fright, test your mettle at Ghosts on the Balcony. Okay, I've got the doctor. I think I'm done now. <laughs> <laughs> You're done when we no. say you're done. <laughs> I'm gonna be like, run, Michelle! <laughs> the family fr friendly haunts are from 2 to 5 p.m. They're recommended for kids 12 and under and are more of a festive Halloween experience. The adult haunts. I'm gonna be with the kids, so I don't know. <laughs> have start times that run from 7 p.m. to 1 a.m. Children under 13 can attend with a legal guardian. I'm good. I'll be out there babysitting your kids. Anybody want to, some adults want to go in? I'll watch your kids while you're in there.